Hi guys, my name is Lena Semenek and welcome to my channel Psychology of Happiness, where happiness is the purpose of life. Today's topic is how men fall in love, how women fall in love, what makes a man fall in love with woman, what makes a woman fall in love with men. There are two different things, women and men are different, so let's start. If you did not see my video how to make a man love you forever, I will leave the link below this video. There are seven things that you should know how to make your man to love you forever. And it works with any man, any age, any social class, any nationality, any religious. Make sure to check it out. So let's talk about how men fall in love, how women fall in love. So if uh, to say just in the simple words, uh, for men, man brain works like uh, multiple centers of control. So he has a control center uh, that is uh, responsible for his job, a control center that is responsible for his house, for his car, for his relationship with friends, relationship with you, relationship with parents. So there are different control centers and they work separately. And he has a big, huge control center that is responsible for logic in his life. He has a huge control center that is responsible for sex in his life. And he has small, small, tiny control center that is responsible for feelings and emotions. And a woman is completely different. For her, it's one big panel with different buttons. And sometimes one button is responsible for several things. Uh, what about logic? For women, it's a small, small part of her control panel that's called logic. Huge button for emotions and feelings. And the sex department is kind of like a little bit in logic, a little bit in uh, uh, emotions, a little bit uh, in her friends department. So for a woman, there are all mixed up. All things are all together. So what's happening when a man falls in love? First, his department for the sex, which is huge. First, this department should be activated. When a man sees a woman, he either likes her or not. He either wants her or not. So if a man wants you, if you meet a guy and he's showing his sexual desire towards you, this is like, wow. So his main control center is active. It means you have a green light to go. So when uh, a woman uh, saying, is saying that, you know, all men wants just sex, it means that she is attracted to a lot of guys. Because for guys, emotions like small, tiny uh, control painters somewhere far, far away. But sex is a big, big button. This button is like beam, 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 beam. It means that you are sexually attracted to him. So this is the first step. A man will never marry, will never date a woman who is not sexually attracted to him. A man will not date a woman uh, if he does not want her sexually. Uh, what's happening for a woman? For her, it's all about emotions. Like she said, oh my God, he's such a nice guy. Oh my God, when he's calling me, when he's texting me, I feel this like uh, sensation inside of me. I feel these butterflies. When he's looking at me, there is something. I feel this passion. I feel this warm feelings inside me. So it's not about... Uh, Mm, his uh, maybe education, it's not about his uh, family, his values, his interests. Uh, she might not even know all those things about the man, but she thinks that she's already in love with him. So for a woman, it's all emotional. It's all about feelings. So a woman often mm, thinks that she knows right away if she likes him or not. So for her, it's about feelings. And for men, it's about sex and logic. So first, the sex center is activated, but the logic center is a different. And uh, a man needs time to connect those two centers. Basically, uh, he has to explain himself like, wow, we have the same interest. Wow, we 
uh, are interested in the same topics, we have same values, uh, we both like uh, hiking, we both like going to movie, we both like sushi. So he needs time to create multiple connections and explain himself why you are the one, why he wants to date you specifically. And what often happens? So a woman thinks that she is in love with a man, she sees that he shows his sexual interest towards her and she uh, feels feels like they have a special connection so she thinks like i will go into deep relationship i will have sex with him i will create this energy between us so she's going and she's offering sex oh he is asking for sex she's offering it does not really matter uh, let's say there is the first date, second date, or third date, and they have sex. Uh, for her, it's to make them closer together. For her, it's to make this connection stronger. For her, it's she's putting uh, herself, she's bringing something more important, valuable into the relationship. And for him, for him, it's different. For him, it's just sex. His emotions department is so far away, so and he needs to connect it. So for him, it's just sex. Then it's logic, and then it's emotions. So what's happening? Once the guy gets what he wants, then for him is what's next. That's it. So his sexual uh, center, control center, uh, was activated, and while it was activated he satisfied his desire so for him there is no reason to fall in love with a woman for him you know all the goals already fulfilled so why he needs to explain himself uh, that this woman is great why he needs to create this connection between those centers there's no reason for that so once he has sex that's it uh, the goal is achieved, so there is no reason to do anything else. And if he, like, yes, he might enjoy it, he might want to see it again, but basically you're fulfilling his goal, first, second, third, fifth time, so usually like those relationships can be for, you know, up to 10 dates, plus or minus, uh, you know, a little bit more, a little bit less, but up to 10 dates uh, in general. So once he receives sex, that's it. So in order for man to fall in love, he needs time. And the sexual interest will help him to jump from the uh, sex department into the logic department, into the feeling department. And for women, it's happening right away. So dear women, if you want a man to fall in love with you, do not rush. Do not rush with the sex you will have the sex. You can actually tell him that. You can say, you know what? I really like you. I think you're great. I really enjoy spending time with you. And I'm sure one day we're gonna have incredible sex. We're gonna enjoy each other so much. It's gonna be amazing. But you know, not today. Not today. I wanna know you. I wanna know more about you. I wanna hang out with you. I wanna talk to you. I wanna, you know, go, you know, different uh, places with your experience. Uh, so tell him that uh, you will have sex and you're looking forward to have sex with him, but do not rush. Let him to connect his sexual desire with his logic and with his feelings. And also give yourself a time. Uh, give yourself a time to know a guy. You need to connect also your emotions with your sexual desires, with your logic. If all three things are gonna fall into a place, then it's gonna be a happy, uh, loving, passionate, sexual, profound, incredible, amazing, enjoyable relationship. And this is what actually you deserve. So do not rush. Think about this video, share your comments below. What do you think? How do you fall in love? What do you think is um, important for you to fall in love with a guy or with a woman? Share your thoughts below. Uh, let's talk uh, about this a little bit more. 
I would like to know your opinion. Share this video with your friends, post it on the Facebook, Twitter, subscribe to my channel, click the bell icon to receive notification of new videos that I post every week. And thank you for watching Psychology of Happiness, where happiness is the purpose of life. If you did not see my video how to make a man love you forever, I will leave the link below this video. There are seven things that you should know how to make your man to love you forever. And it works with any man, any age, any social class, any nationality, any religious. Make sure to check it out.